The next guy we want to talk about, Austin Reeves. Austin Reeves resigned with the Lakers on a four-year, $56 million deal. And I think this is probably the deal that allowed the Lakers to make all these moves. Because the reason why we thought the Lakers wouldn't have room to sign Rui Hachimura, because Austin Reeves completely earned and played himself into a conversation where he could potentially earn $80 million. And I think he, I think if he would have gotten that contract, I don't think any, you would hear a complaint from any of us because he absolutely deserved that money. He worked hard. He played well in the regular season. He was a huge playoff performer. Uh, and he, he fits so many different teams. And he's very young. And he's super young. So the guy was absolutely, absolutely deserved an $80 million deal. But he decided to take a discount to stay with the Lakers. Now, granted, he wasn't RFA, so there probably was a lot more restrictions with him involved. But he decided to stay with the Lakers on a very, very team-friendly deal. Uh, and I think I for the Lakers, it's a huge win. I would say for Austin Reeves, maybe you could have gotten a little bit more. But hey, when how many more opportunities are you going to play with next to LeBron James? Well, I think from what I've seen, uh, $56 million was the most the Lakers could literally give to Austin Reeves. Um, so I think... I think the, the the rationale behind this is that the opportunity, I think, that comes with playing with the Lakers, the, let's say, you know, $20 million he lost playing somewhere else, I think will be recouped playing for the Los Angeles Lakers, Endorsing, playing yeah. especially next to LeBron James. Um, so I think he'll, you know, he recoups that value somewhere else. But I, I remember when I saw that notification for Austin Reeves re-signing, the, uh, you know, on a $56 million deal, I had to, like, check my phone twice because I was like, no way this happened. Like, $56 million for Austin Reeves. Because he deserves more. He absolutely de- deserves a higher, higher higher, check. But considering the fact that I think this is a player that truly wanted to value situation, and he realized he's in a pretty good spot with the Lakers. I think per value, you know, per dollar, um, the value that you're getting from this contract, I think this might have legit been the best signing of the offseason. 